Hi Aquarius, welcome to your reading. This is going to be for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Venus, and Rising. Let's see what's going on with you when it comes to your love life and your life in general. We have grass is greener. Ex-lover, okay. Proposal and unexpected. <laughs> okay interesting energy some of you may be either you're wondering if the grass is greener on the other side or you guys ended up in separation because your person was wondering but it seems like someone's changing their mind here <laughs> someone is changing their mind they may pop up unexpectedly so especially if you're dealing with someone who you know thought they had it all figured out when they left you huh <sighs> Let's see. What do we have for Aquarius? What does Aquarius... Oh, gosh. What does Aquarius need to know right now? Okay, love is a verb. Actions speak louder than words. Hmm. Could it be that this... Yeah, reaching out. They will be reaching out unexpectedly. For a lot of you, I... I... I believe this. I believe this. I don't doubt it based on what I'm seeing. What do we have for Aquarius? Friends to lovers. Hmm. So this could have been you and your person. If you're single, you could end up becoming the lover of a friend of yours. <laughs> we have the, sorry, be the change. Hmm. Could this be the key to you guys actually experiencing this unexpected contact? Focusing on loving you, changing yourself for the better. Let's see. What's going on with Aquarius in love and in general? What's going on with Aquarius? Oh, God. What do we have for Aquarius? Please give me some accurate messages for Aquarius. Okay. Queen of Swords. Some of you have your guard up at the moment. You're definitely focusing on you because of something that went on here. This person is kind of going through it emotionally. They, I'm already seeing that this person, I don't know if they're already starting to realize how they feel about you or if this is soon to be, but it's showing up in this reading that. They are becoming more clear and more accepting of their feelings for you. So if you guys are in separation, it's getting to that point where they might reach out. Um, four of Wands in reverse is how they are seeing you. They see you as somewhat unstable. I don't know if you lash out at this person or what, or if you just not well, like if they feel like you're just not welcoming them back with open arms. So for them, it could be a big risk to reach out to you. They may be thinking, okay, my actions are going to speak louder than words. So they may be thinking about showing you their, their feelings rather than telling you. But, hmm, a lot of you have released this person or you're on the verge of just letting this go and focusing on you, which is, you know, air sign, true air sign style. Not stressing about things, just keeping it flowing, okay? You have the Nine of Cups in reverse as how you're seeing this person. So they've really disappointed you in this situation. This this relationship could be fated to work with the Judgment card as mutual energy. But it's just like you guys are going through something, obviously, at the moment. Yeah, this person's trying to figure out or they feel like they went once they feel like they have it figured out, they will come forward. I feel like their goal is to show you rather than tell you. And you're currently 
trying to feel better, trying to heal here. But there is this energy of both of you being stuck on the past, uh, being stuck on this relationship. Neither of you have let it go, even if you're not speaking. I'm seeing that currently you're going through some kind of transformation or the universe is pushing you to transform, especially with the Be The Change card. You're definitely being pushed to change something or transform something about yourself not to please others but to make yourself better to heal yourself to improve yeah i'm hearing the quality of your life so this is like an overall change this is like a personal change for you and reconciliation is definitely emphasized here with the three of cups but we have this two of cups here it's in the position of your work and money which is kind of confusing me <laughs> some of you may have some kind of contracts that you're going to get some kind of partnership but it could be that either you work with this person or especially if you're single you may end up being with someone that you work with someone you're friends with and work with wow okay it's a lot it's a lot let me see <laughs> Eight of Swords in Reverse. Why is this person feeling this way? Four of Wands in Reverse again. So they may... Okay, wait. What is this? They are dead. Like King of Cups in Reverse. Queen of Cups in Reverse. Feeling unstable. They're definitely going through something seriously to do with their emotions. But you got the page of cups here so i don't know if it's them feeling unstable with you or unstable without you because there's something about instability and emotional instability yet they're coming forward with this offer so it's like it must be them feeling unstable without you or else why would they be reaching out coming forward Why the four of wands in reverse? Yeah, yeah, they're feeling unstable about the breakup. Two of cups in reverse. Now it makes sense. Now the queen of cups is upright. <laughs> so this person feels like the only way to feel better, to get past this emotional instability, this feeling, this horrible feeling they're feeling, is to reconcile with you. They're gonna eventually realize that, and it could be very soon. Why the Two of Cups? Aquarius. Some of you, if, if a... Okay, okay. Some of you may become so... Um, so involved in this connection. Maybe, I don't know if they're going to propose. Some of you, it could be that they propose and you end up kind of shifting your focus from work towards this whirlwind of... I don't know wedding plans or this romantic um you know this you know when you kind of just only think about your person <laughs> all day you wake up thinking about them you go to bed thinking about them i don't know if you guys reconciliation is gonna be like to that point like they show you and make you kind of go in this fairy tale la la land where you kind of forget about everything else for some of you that could be the case others of you there may be a contract or something to do with work some partnership that fell flat or it's something you may need to be aware of because there could be someone toxic trying to work with you just keep that in mind i feel like that's if you already know or suspected that there's someone toxic trying to make some kind of deal with you and you kind of your gut is telling you no why the four of swords in reverse something's gonna become clear to you it could be yeah, the death card you guys may be coming out of conflict. You guys are coming out of a break. Some kind of transformation, um, some kind of change in the way this person does things or them kind of making it clear to you. It's something about them showing you, like I said, showing you rather than telling you about their feelings, about their love for you. It's, it's, it's more about that showing you and, and you actually seeing it and being clear about it and things transform things change in this connection and you guys come out of conflict 
Hmm. Okay. It's blocking is a fool card. So the fact that this person just hasn't taken that leap yet. Why is the fool here? Yeah, it's all about them making that move. All that's blocking the situation is they haven't made this move yet. When they do make this contact, you're probably going to be floating on air is what I'm hearing. When they prove it to you. Why the four of cups in reverse? Keep in mind, I'm being reminded to tell you there is some change that you need to make within yourself. It could be to do with healing. Strength. For others of you, like some of you are dealing with, a, some of you have some other partner. Either you have another person while you're in separation from this person, or they do, or they left because they felt like the grass was greener. Whoever felt like the grass was greener is dropping that other option. You see? They're choosing the stronger option. So you may be the stronger person for them, the person they feel strongly about. They may have been someone's bored by the by a third party. Bored and just not interested in them. Someone really thought the grass was greener on the other side. That's what I'm getting. What's going on with Aquarius? What are the love messages for Aquarius? Euphoria, you see? It's going to be some kind of whirlwind. Like, it's going to be all you can think about. You got mirroring, and this, this is why there's some change that you need to make. This is why we have be the change, because there's something about you. There's something about them that you don't like, and you may not realize that you also have that same trait, and you may need to just correct it if you want them to come at you correct as well. Forgiveness and communication. You are going to be speaking. I'm telling you, they're going to reach out to you. Reach out unexpected in communication. I'm not doubting this at all. There's no doubt in my mind. No doubt. What do we have for Aquarius when it comes to love? Young. Oh, God. Okay, I'm going to take all of them. Young female, it's three cards, but I'm taking them. So young female, music, youthful fashion, fair male, lighter than dogs. Maybe you have light hair. I'm seeing all hair colors. See, well, not all hair colors, but light, dark, and colored hair. So we have mature woman, socialite, connect to high society, past life, knowing deja vu, past love. So, you guys are reconnecting for sure. There's definitely, hmm, something about maturity here as well. I'm not sure what it is, but let's see. If your person has immature behavior, they may be growing up in a way. What do we have for Aquarius? look deeper in the details you see there's something that you don't like with this person that you may not know that you also do some trait you also have i know it's easier for us to point at others and say you are this and you are that but do we look at ourselves we look at others more often than we look at ourselves laugh it out so you may actually find what that is and find it funny that you have been doing the same thing without realizing karmic interventions the universe separated you guys the universe separated you guys straight up because you need to see something in yourself and correct it and they also need to show and prove that that they love you for real so Two benefits there, you're transforming and they're getting the point that they need to start showing and proving. So there's a really bright side to it. We have dive in. I feel like you guys are gonna like, when you guys start talking and they prove to you, you're gonna be like, just that's what I feel like, you're just gonna get sucked into thinking about them all day. You guys probably be in bed all day together, not focused. <laughs> Not focusing on your responsibilities. Maybe not for a long period of time, but just expect to kind of be irresponsible or something like that when 
you guys reconnect and finding it funny that you guys are like just focusing on love and not adult life but yes reconnect let me clarify that death card why is the death card here for aquarius yeah, you see, there's something you got to work on to make this transformation happen. And when you do with the Ace of Swords, it's going to be insane. Like the change, you're going to come out triumphant. It may even help you to improve your work life as well. There's just something you need to work on. I'm hearing some of you may be impulsive or make impulsive decisions. So you may have to work on that or something like that. You know what I mean? Something that causes things to fall apart is what you're working on. Restoring balance. Could be dealing with Libra, Scorpio, Leo, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. There's Aries, Energy, there's Capricorn, Taurus, Aquarius like yourself. And those are the main signs. So Aquarius, I hope this was helpful for you. Feel free to Check your other placements if you want to know what else is going on here. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.